back to my channel, but first things first, I'm going to give credit when credit's due. I was jamming to Chris Brown's new album this whole entire video. So if you see me doing a little dance here and there, that's what I'm listening to. But um, I'm using the 35O matte palette for Morphe, and I'm only going to be using two colors. That first color I showed you, I just put that all over my crease. And then I'm going to go in with my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. And to find my crease, I usually just look bend my head down and then I look up with my eyes and that's where I'm going to cut my crease and this is just another Morphe brush all my brushes that I used are going to be listed down in the description box and I'm just going to be cutting my crease halfway then I'm taking my airspun powder on this big fluffy brush I'm just going to be setting all of that dusting it off and then dusting the excess off my eyes taking that color that I showed you it's more skin tone and then I'm just going to be putting that all over my lid with my finger taking that color from the first from my crease and I'm just going to be blending that in taking my elf liner and I don't know how I did this on camera yo my skills are getting up there because look look how crisp that eyeliner is look at it and I managed to do this on camera and I put my lashes on camera yo when I tell you mm, I'm just getting up there my skills look I put my eyelashes on on camera bruh mm. next I'm taking my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte favorite foundation favorite drugstore foundation I'm just going to be using this as my foundation for today I didn't prime or color correct because this foundation covers everything and it doesn't need a primer take my beauty blender I'm gonna be blending all that in don't forget your neck, ladies. Don't forget your neck. Or boys. Dang, I was blending for a long time. Come on. Next. I'm a mess. Next, I'm taking my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer to conceal and then my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Toffee to highlight. The Maybelline Concealer is in Cafe. And I'm going to put and I'm going to be putting this underneath my eyes, down the bridge of my nose, on my chin, and on my forehead. And I'm just gonna be blending my life away. Oh, and I always make sure to pull my nose to the side so I can get the concealer right in there because, I don't know, it always looks weird when I don't do that. It's like foundation and concealer never gets into that little crease of my nose. So, yeah. Blend, blend, blend. Taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kitchen Deep. I'm just going to be using the middle color and the first color on the last row to create a contour. And I'm taking my Coastal Sense brush. Again, all of the brush numbers will be listed down in the description box. And I'm going to be blend, 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 blend. I've been really loving cream contour lately. Like, it just makes you look so snatched. You don't have to go over it with the powder. Oh, yeah, and I skipped setting underneath my eyes because that part was out of focus. But I just used my Sasha Buttercup. And I set underneath my eyes. Down the bridge of my nose, my forehead, and also I always like to set up my smile lines, but I always wipe it off immediately because I find that if I don't, if I let it sit there, it creates that, I don't know, it just creates a weird looking thing around my mouth. It's just really bright. And then I'm going to contour my nose. If you haven't already watched my nose contouring video, what are you doing? I'll leave it in a card up above. Taking my Morphe 06 PW palette, and I'm going to use this to contour, and then using that second color right next to it to bronze. Now I'm taking that first color I put in my crease. I'm going to use this to put underneath my what is this lash line? Yeah, my bottom lash line. Taking my favorite highlighter of all time, Betty Luminizer by the Bomb beautiful look at that look at that glow then I'm taking my Fenty Beauty highlighter in Hustle Baby for my nose NYX setting spray the matte one to finish it off and then my ColourPop gloss in Weehoo 
this just makes my lips look so juicy. And here are some slow mos. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to comment and like. And for the love of makeup and all things girly, please subscribe and stay tuned for my next video. Bye, guys.